And new tonight, a student who attends college in Bristol County is fighting for her life. After a serious accident, the Stonehill College student was studying abroad in Spain when she got in a bike accident. Now friends and family are coming together to bring her home for treatment. We spoke with her father tonight. It wasn't even my little girl. An emotional interview with Dave Rossio from his hotel room in Mallorca, a small island in Spain, after seeing his daughter Lauren in critical condition after a tragic bike accident. And she was studying in Paris for a semester, and the kids came here for a weekend, and the last thing they were doing before they flew back was like, hey, let's take a bike ride. Dave went to the scene to see for himself where the accident took place. And I'm like, oh, she came down from that hill. And they said, no, no, no. She came down from that hill. And I looked up, and I'm, oh, my. Oh, you know, and I can only imagine the, the speed she had coming down. He says there's different accounts of what happened, but believes she was trying to avoid a car by taking a turn. Once she took that turn, she didn't have a chance. Now a GoFundMe is circulating to help transfer Lauren to a specialized pediatric ICU trauma unit in Boston and help with other costs. My concern is, is my daughter going to live? Is she going to be okay? The family from Londonderry, New Hampshire, is thanking everyone who has donated, including her classmates at Stonehill College in Easton. From the bottom of my heart, and on behalf of my daughter, thank you for all the prayers. And I, I know people have been raising money for us, and that's amazing. But for me, the prayers saved her life. And Dave says he's determined to find the first responders who made sure Lauren has a fighting chance. But I'm going to go find him so the police will meet me here at the hotel tomorrow because I'm not leaving this island without thanking those guys for saving my daughter's life. Such a tragedy, and we are, of course, hoping for the best for Lauren and her family. The link to that GoFundMe is going to be on our website, turn to 10com